So if we put NaCl and HCl together, we want to know what happens if there's a reaction that takes place. So sodium chloride, and this is hydrochloric acid, the strong acid. So first off, we'll have sodium chloride, and we would expect this to be aqueous. It would dissolve in water. Compounds with the sodium ion are very soluble. So this would dissolve in water, dissociate into its ions. Hydrochloric acid, that's a strong acid. So it's also going to dissolve completely and dissociate into its ions completely. Sodium will form ions that are 1 plus. The chloride ion, that's 1 minus. Hydrogen is 1 plus, And again, the chloride, 1 minus. So we can use this information to figure out what might happen. So we have these together. They're all broken apart into these ions. What could happen? The sodium, that could join with this chloride here. And this hydrogen, it could join with this chloride right here in a double displacement reaction. So that would give us an idea what the products might be. But here's the thing. If we took sodium, this sodium here, and it joined with this chloride ion, and then we took the hydrogen here, and we put it with this chloride ion, we end up exactly with the same thing we started with. So these would still be dissolved in solution. So you start out with all of these dissolved in solution. You end up with them all dissolved. Nothing's changed. No reaction takes place. So in answer to our question, NaCl plus HCl, there will be no chemical reaction. There is something interesting that does happen, though. It's called the common ion effect. If you have a solution of sodium chloride that's saturated, it's holding all of the sodium chloride that it can hold, and you add hydrochloric acid, because you're adding more chloride ions, you can actually cause the sodium chloride to precipitate out. So some of it will fall out as a solid. This is really a physical process, though. It's not a chemical process. But it is worth noting, and it's kind of interesting to watch. There's a link in the description and then at the end of this video of someone actually doing this, where they have concentrated sodium chloride, they add concentrated hydrochloric acid, and those extra chloride ions from the hydrochloric acid cause the NaCl to form a solid of precipitate. But in answer to our original question, NaCl plus HCl, there's no chemical reaction. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.